just as I want to go out the door. She jumps up on me as I'm putting my shirt on. But a boom. No warning. I get hit in the back and clawed in the back as she climbed up my back. I'm probably bleeding right now. Does it really hurt? She, she's got one of her fish hooks in my mid back. On the right side of the spinal cord, boy, and she went deep. Man, she didn't mean it. She loves me. Look at this. She loves me. See, look, I'm standing up, walking around the house. All of a sudden, wham, you get hit in the back with a pussycat that wants to show you love. <laughs> She's a good mama pussycat, isn't she? She's a good girl. She was going to die. I saved her life. She had six babies and not only three working teats. There were only three good teats with six babies. No, no, no. That don't work. That amounts to at least three dead babies if you, in my book. So I had a hand feed. I fed her bowls of the stuff formula and syringes to all the babies and now all the babies are two years and a week old almost they're two years old and uh, let's see, they were born on the, tw on the 11th and 12th one of them was born like 10 minutes to midnight on the 11th and all the rest were born before 6 a.m. Uh, on the 12th Two of September, two years ago. See, I want to go out the door. I got to go to Napa. I got to go to the pharmacy. I got to, I got to go to uh, the dealership. And uh, she don't want me to go out. And uh, so I guess I got to stay a little while. She can get mad. She can get mad. And they jump up on top of everything I don't want them on and protest. They do do that. They throw things off the table. They throw things off the countertops onto the floor to make noise. And then they look at me because they want me to play with them. <laughs> I love you guys. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. oh, I hear Simba meowing in the window. They all want to go outside, but I need to go food shopping. I'm going to the diner first. I gotta go to the diner, eat a couple eggs and hash toast and taters and coffee juice and side order of pancake. And uh, then maybe I, ah, there we go. <laughs> What's up, Tigress? Pussycat Mama. I don't know. They don't want to eat the nine lives. About a quarter to a third of a can a day between the four cats. That's all they will eat. If I don't feed them anything else, they still won't eat any more of that. They just don't like it. And uh, I guess they only eat that when everything else runs out. That's when they'll eat the nine lives. I'm sorry, nine lives, but I don't know. They just don't want it. They prefer the fancy feast, the real deal fancy feast, or a real can of tuna fish. Anyway. And Rachel Ray's kibble. Rachel Ray kibble there, the no grain one, they go crazy for it, that's, that's their kibble now, they don't want nothing else, so, nine lives, I've been feeding the stray cats in the neighborhood, I know there's some stray cats around here, or raccoons and stuff, so I just put the shit outside, man, and it gets eaten right up, anyway, that's it, Everybody has a good day today. I'm really having a hard time moving myself and breathing. 
I don't know, this building, yeah, my house might be clean, my condo inside my unit, you know, might be safe, they say, but the rest of this building ain't safe, man. I can't go in the basement. Uh, yeah. Sometimes the elevator, and, 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 and it triggers an asthma attack. Yeah, and I got COPD, emphysema on top of it, you know, fatal terminal illness. That's how I'm going to die, they say. It's a miracle I'm still here. A friend of mine, Pete Sabini, had this shit. He died. He didn't last. Uh, I don't know how I'm doing, but thank God I'm still here, man. Trying to make the best out of every day and trying to make other people's days better, too. Well, oh, man, look at this. Come on. Simba, you're going to get hurt, pussycat. You're going to get hurt. Get, thank you. Here, I got to pull this away from me. All right, I gotta go out.